Hi guys and welcome back to Lingoni. My name is Jenny. I'm Jacqueline. And today we're going to play a game with you which will help you learn German articles. Some of you may already know that there are three German articles. Der, which is the masculine article, die, which is the feminine article, and das, which is the neutral art article. So whenever you learn a new word in German, whenever you learn a new noun, you have to learn the corresponding article together with the noun. That's really important. So how does this game work? It's actually really easy. I'm going to say a word and Jacqueline has 15 seconds to tell me as many words as possible related to that word. So for example, if I say shoes, she has to say boots or socks or anything that she associates with that word, right? And you guys can take part as well. So get out a pen and a piece of paper and when you hear me say that word, you just write down as many words as possible associated with that word. And you can even write them in the comments and we'll correct you. Oh, and by the way, she should be as quick as possible. So she has to name as many words as she can think of as fast as she can within 15 seconds. And also, we're always going to say the article along with the noun so that it's easier for you to learn the article together with the noun. So are you ready? I'm ready. Los geht's. Die Schuhe. Die Füße, die Schnürsenkel, äh, die Sportschuhe, ähm, die Socken, die Schuhsohle. Ähm, Stopp. Gut. Okay. Nächstes Wort. Das ist Stress für mich. <lacht> okay. Nee, ich hätte schwitzen. <lacht> die Angst. Die Aufregung, der Schweiß, <lacht> das rote Gesicht, das Herz, der Puls, die Nervosität, die Gänsehaut. Stopp. Oh, das waren 20 Sekunden. Naja, ist nicht so schlimm. Das merkt keiner. Der Balkon. Die Luft, die Pflanzen, das Gerüst. Die Bank, die Aussicht, das Wetter, der Stuhl. Alles okay, weiter? Mir fällt nichts mehr ein. <lacht> Stopp. Okay. Du wirst langsam ein bisschen besser. Der Urlaub. Die Sonne, die Wolken, der Sonnenschirm, der Sand, der Badeanzug, die Flipflops. Der Spaß, der Liegestuhl, der Sonnenhut. Stopp. Hm. Ich glaube, du brauchtest eine kleine Aufwärmphase. Ich glaube auch. <lacht> okay. Äh, die Haare. Der Friseur, die Haarspange, das Haargummi, die Bürste, das Shampoo, die Spülung, der Kamm. Die Frisur. Stop. Okay. By the way, we're not just playing this game because it's fun, but also because this is a great way to learn new vocabulary. So you take one word and then you name as many words as possible within that group. And that way you can remember the articles in a much better way. Die Straße. Das Auto, das Fahrrad, der Fußgänger, der Verkehr, der Stau. Der Passant, die Ampel, Stopp. das Bett, der Schlaf, das Kissen, die Bettdecke, die Matratze. Stopp. Boah, das war eigentlich schwer. Okay, so now we're going to switch. Now I have to tell her as many words as possible associated to the word that she's going to choose for me. Let's go. Let's go. Das Wohnzimmer. Die Couch oder das Sofa, der Fernseher, ähm, die Gäste, der Besuch, äh, die Kissen, der Teppich, die Fenster. Stopp! Oh, das war nicht so gut. Der Umzug. Der Stress, die Umzugsfirma, der Umzugshelfer, die Kartons, ähm, die Kaution, die Miete. 
Stopp! Uh, das war auch nicht so gut. Die Arbeit. Der Chef oder die Chefin, ähm, die Arbeitszeit, die Aufgaben, der Laptop, die Anweisungen, ähm, der Wecker, der Arbeitsweg. Stopp! Uh, auch nicht so gut. Lingoni. Uh, die Videos, die Podcasts, die interaktiven Übungen, die Livestreams, die Produktion von Lernmaterial, ähm, die Mitarbeiter, ähm, die Planung, die Organisation. Oh. Das Tier. Die Wildnis, die Freiheit, die Instinkte, das Fell, die Krallen, der Tierschutz. Äh, Stopp. Okay. Der Supermarkt. Die Lebensmittel, die Kasse, das Obst, das Gemüse, die Milch, die Butter, der Saft, das Wasser. Stopp. Der Kleiderschrank. Die Kleiderbügel, die Klamotten oder die Anziehsachen, ähm, der Platz. Die Hosen, die Oberteile, die Jeans, die Pullover. Stop. Uff. So you learned a ton of new vocabulary today, including nouns and their articles. So um, why don't you play this game regularly with your friends or um, with your teachers? Because this will really help you improve your vocabulary and just really start to master these German articles. If you want more practice, you can find over 600 PDF worksheets as well as over 17,000 interactive exercises on Lingoni.com. You'll be able to improve your reading, writing and listening skills and even practice pronunciation. And we now have how many languages at Lingoni? Three! We have German, French and American English. Yeah, so if you're interested in any of those other languages, go check us out at Lingoni.com and you can choose your language there and get started learning with Lingoni. Vielen Dank, bis zum nächsten Mal. Tschüss! Tschüss.